know how much power your devices and appliances need? This is an often misunderstood part of installing solar. So before we start installing anything at all, I'm going to walk you through the basics of calculating your energy usage so you can size your solar system properly. For example, my calculated estimated daily energy consumption is 5 kilowatt hours. Before I reveal how I got that number, let's review some basic electrical safety. Let's start by reviewing voltage. AC voltage moves in waves. Those waves help electricity move long distances without losing power. When it reaches your wall outlets, it's a deadly 120 volts, so be careful when you're dealing with AC. DC is found in batteries and modern electronics, which are usually low voltage devices and therefore safe to touch. However, they can still easily start a fire if shorted. All live circuits have dangers associated with them, but usually the more power, the more dangerous it is. Okay, let's get back to our load analysis. Our biggest load is the microwave, which I measured at 2000 watts. The term watts describes how much power is flowing through something. You can measure electrical power by measuring current and voltage or with a literal watt meter. If you want to learn about making these measurements yourself, let me know in the comments. Luckily, I've made a document listing all of the power requirements for all of the loads in the Terra Oasis, including a phone and a laptop. Download it and I'll show you how to use it. The goal of this document is to estimate how many kilowatts of energy you'll need while off-grid. Let's start with the first row, which is the microwave. I'll add three minutes for reheating two meals, eight minutes for cooking something like a potato, and most days I'll want three minutes for something like popcorn. That totals to 17 minutes of total microwave usage per day. Now I'm going to divide that by 60 because we want everything in this column to be in terms of hours. Next, take a look at the energy column. It automatically calculated 2000 watts times 0.3 hours to get 567 watt hours, which is my daily microwave energy use. The total daily figure will update accordingly as you adjust the daily usage columns below to reflect your lifestyle. Make sure to input daily usage for each load and add loads as needed. And that's how I used my load analysis worksheet to determine that my daily energy requirements are 5 kilowatt hours. We'll revisit this number when we talk about purchasing solar panels. Next, I want you to watch my video on assessing the roof space of the Terra Oasis so you know how many solar panels you can practically fit.